it's all based on again understanding power so every system is built on the yin yang or the yum yum principle of soft and hard yao gong once you understand that then you understand your body so when you're practicing you're not just you got to be able to get that power out so you have to understand all these circles and the straight lines which is the square action and those two combined they never separate <clears throat> so that's true uh, understanding of the ging within the body it takes years but when you practice you're not just like this and it's the hand it's a full latch like this and it grabs and then you gotta understand the force from here to here with this when I grab and I'm gonna use my hip and it can then spiral in. Then when I step, I use my Yuma elbow here. Patro Bunchup and so forth. So you gotta understand the in between the yin yang, the yao gong for you to produce this power, the mysterious ging. How do we do that? <clears throat> in the jigbo, right? <clears throat> we rise but we don't float. Right? We sink but we don't fall. Differences. So we rise but we don't float. It's controlled. And if you hold too much tension when you uh, rise and you've got too much tension in the body and they find your center, you will float through the air. You're already uprooted. When you sink, you drop down like this, compressing the dantian and you pull in the stomach and the power should shoot out like a starter pistol, yeah? So I can use this, the dog's having a heart attack. You, <clears throat> as you breathe in, <clears throat> your tongue, and then it changes to the yin yang and out. So this pulley system here to push out, and then when I grab, I'm going to use my body as if I've got a rope like this. I've got another one, and out it comes. All right. So no matter what you're doing, the nine step, same. So you do your drills, right? The rise and fall. Elbows slightly pull in. Don't overdo it because you lose your structure in our system. We don't believe in pulling in the elbows too much until you cover. Regardless, anyway, this is the way we do it. So, you've got your, your build you right, which you know, like this, like that, All right? So if I do, do it with uh, soft and hard power, like this, then that grabs, the power comes through, back down. Then it pushes back up through the legs again with your punch rising. Think of the roller bar now, right? Back down. Up. Down. Up. Down. And then you can change the other way. Up. Down. Up. Down. Then you shorten your power so your arms are out, the, the bridge is stretched out, like this. So your body is like a shock absorber. Yeah? So you can still issue the power from here, not just from here. The power becomes a wave, a little spiral.
the difference with the Bak Fu Pai when they do the same here their Chung Bo Kyun has the lot or the top then uses this as a mechanism for this bottom hand to shoot out like this to the ribs then one two three pull back single whip like so so you can see how the power is in unity <laughs> 